so what a complete and utter palaver um only noticed it because somebody kindly told me that my uh, water was coming out at the bottom of the caravan so i got in today and had a look and thank goodness it hadn't been left any longer but basically it was wetting inside and it's wet all my sofa i'm going to show you so i've mopped it all up i don't know whether it's me that's made the mistake or whether because it's never happened to me before and i've been living in this now 18 months or most of the toilet paper is sodden it's wet the carpet where I put the sofa on the carpet afterwards because that was sodden. So I'm going to show you everything now. But I just cannot believe that this has happened. I've got somebody coming out to have a look at it. But it's like, what the hell? Um, have I had that much go wrong at the start of 2022? This is not my year, by the way. This is definitely not my year so far. Um, and I'm hoping that what I've done today is going to save it but anyway i've called the guy he's hopefully coming out um tomorrow steve he's called he's either out tomorrow or he's out um well tomorrow thursday or friday i'm hoping that he's out as soon as he can i'm hoping when i switch the water on tomorrow that it's not going to um start a leak he doesn't know whether a part has been pulled out he doesn't know what's happened but basically it has leaked i've had to use several microfiber cloths um i've all absolutely sodden that is sodden and it's dirty as well uh, where i've been wiping around the pipe pipe work because obviously you don't wipe that it's sodden is a copy excuse me because i've piled it up on my head while i've been uh, trying to sort this stuff out and then i've had a heater on and then i've had to take the sofa somewhere else to be against the radiator because that was dripping wet through that's got slight watermarks which i'll show you in this video as well but uh -huh. <laughs> I've had it off. Let's see, and I'll show you what's happened. Um, I need to dry out my toilet rolls as well, or does that sound really bad? Just go and get some new ones, yeah. So this is the absolute nightmare. I can feel it sodden underneath my feet on the carpet. Um, so I've obviously got to let that dry out. This was wet through. I mean, I didn't film it as soon as it happened because obviously I was just so frightened. I just wanted to get it all up. So um, I didn't bother getting my camera out and go, oh, look at this, it's flooded. <laughs> obviously, I can't do that. My tea towel is absolutely wrecked because I grabbed that, um, uh, first of all, um, to clean. So I've mopped it all up. Um, some of these toilet rolls are sodden now. So those are no good. I've got them all out on the sides drying and some on the radiator in the bathroom. And then I've put my heater on um, just to dry it out. <coughs> move that so i've got my heater on um, just to dry it out just to make sure that everything's okay this is um this was wet through as well so obviously drying that out and then um i'll show you where the sofa is so this is the bottom of the you know what you sit on on the sofa and i've just put it against the radiator to try and dry this out so what a mess so i'm going to leave this um i've switched the radiator off overnight but I'm just going to leave it here for it to dry out. But it was it was absolutely sodden at one side. And actually, you can see very, a very slight watermark that you can see down there. Uh, but hoping you won't see that when I've got the cushions on. Because I'm absolutely gutted that this has happened. Absolutely gutted. But my guy, um, the guy that, that comes around and has a look at stuff for me, he's coming around um, hopefully tomorrow to have a look. So I'm hoping, I've got the guy coming round either tomorrow or the day after, this carpet is damp as well. So I'm going to put the heating on overnight, I can feel it, it's absolutely wet through. I'm going to put the heating on overnight, has it gone through? Yeah, it's gone through. So that's a bit damp underneath as well. What a mess, what a mess. Um, so I, I definitely need that on the carpet as well, but I don't want to do that through the night. So I'll switch that off now and um i'll get myself to bed and then i'll dry this uh, in the morning oh i'm so mad i'm so mad i'm like so angry and i just don't know whether it's me that's done it or i can't i just can't think i can't think straight so once the guys come round, also i've got a little bit of a leaky radiator as well so he's going to sort that Uah! so i'm shattered and just ready for bed now i've had enough um quite a lot of bad news recently which i don't enjoy um but hey ho it's a bit of water in a caravan isn't it i've got to get over it and get on with it but i'm like ah oh, i'm mad i'm so mad anyway let's just see what the damage is monetary wise and i'll find out in the next couple of days um what it's done but hopefully i've dried it out caravan is never this messy but i'm having to lift this up because this is it's still wet underneath so i'm having to dry the carpet out now 
and um, I'm just about to switch the shower on to see whether this starts leaking through. Now I've had the taps on and that hasn't altered. So let's switch the light on. I don't want to run it for too long because obviously I'll lose my warm water. So I'll switch the shower on. Let's have a look at what this looks like here. I can't hear or see anything. So I think that's going to be okay. So I'll tell you what this Pratt did. <laughs> um, you know when um, you drain your water when you're packing down your caravan and there's like a little thick lever that you put up to stop the water, um, you know, to, to, to drain your um, tank out. Well, I'd, I'd, when I'd gone and left the caravan, I'd left that on the... So, so no water can get in. Do you know what I mean? So it drains out. And obviously I'd... I'd fitted everything back in and fitted the aqua roll and put the tap on so it's running in water constantly but then it was running in and then running down but it must have leaked through to the caravan so it's my fault basically so I feel like a right idiot um, I think the bill came to about £100 80 to £100 pounds, so <laughs> it's like I caused that do you know what I mean so I feel like I've wasted money but very good of, of Steve to come round anyway <laughs> now you know what I've done now you know I've had that little flood um, I would love to have you part of the YouTube family please please um, hit that subscribe button and also please give us a thumbs up if you loved it and any tips or tricks that you want to leave for me or call me an absolute wallow please do so in the comment section below um, but that subscribe button would mean the world to me thank you for watching as always so from the Pratt <laughs> see you later <laughs> I'll see you on the next vlog